The latest Overwatch patch is now live, and the biggest things to note are the addition of the new Escort map, Rialto, and the rework of the hero Hanzo. Season 10 is live now, which means fans can finally get their hands on Bridget in competitive, but Rialto won't be available in ranked until it's been fully tested elsewhere. There are also smaller changes for Lucio, Tracer, Genji, and Junkrat, as well as some bug fixes for heroes and maps which can all be found below. Related articles Previous one The next KSV rebrands to Gen.G after expanding to China. Who can't? How the Overwatch team designed Retribution. Lead designer. Share this article Share Rialto, which players got a glimpse of in the Retribution brawl during the Archives event in April, is available for play in Arcade, Quick Play, and Custom Games. Rialto was home to Talon agent Antonio Bartolotti's sprawling estate, and the backdrop to the infamous Venice incident, a turning point for Overwatch and Talon, says Blizzard's description. The Italian government has taken great steps to preserve Venice, and the results are striking. Tourists visiting this picturesque town can sample the regional cuisine, enjoy a relaxing gondola ride, visit Galeria d'Art Omnicar, or simply take in the sights with a stroll along the canal. It's an escort map, where you must push the payload through the streets of this Italian city, and people seem pretty happy with it so far. As for the massive changes to Hanzo, he may now be a lot more viable in competitive play than he was previously. His bow's projectile speed has been increased from 85 to 100, and he can now press jump while in mid-air to leap horizontally. His sonic arrow has had its duration and radius reduced, but it can now be cast more often. The biggest change is his storm arrows, which replace Hanzo's current scatter arrow ability. When activated, Hanzo can fire up to six arrows, that are fired at full power, but at reduced damage. The goal of these Hanzo changes is to allow him to have new options, and maintain his high damage output, while removing the frustration of fighting against the old scatter arrow, said the developer comments. Hanzo is now much more mobile with his new lunge ability, and with the combination of the bow projectile speed increase, and the new storm arrows ability he can now deal his high damage more consistently than ever before. Meanwhile, Bridget has had her shield bash cone angle reduced from 90 to 60, meaning it should be more accurate to its visual representation. Apostrophe Genji has had the hitbox on his deflect ability reduced, as previously, it had the ability to reflect projectiles that were pretty far away from him. As for Junkrat, his frag launcher's projectile size has decreased from 0 0.3 to 0.2 making it a little harder to aim, and the reptile's movement speed has been decreased from 13 to 12, 
making it a little easier to take out. Lucio's controversial new wall ride has come into effect, allowing him to go around corners without having to leave the wall. Plus, he can land back on the same wall after leaping away, provided he travels far enough away. Finally, Trace's Pulse Bomb has been reduced from 400 damage to 300. Pulse Bomb was too good at killing tanks, who can be easy to stick due to their size, say the developers. This damage reduction makes it less powerful as a tank destroyer, while keeping it lethal against most other heroes. For the full list of changes and bug fixes, you can find them all on the Blizzard forums. Related articles Previous one The next KSV rebrands to Gen.G after expanding to China. Ku Kent. How the Overwatch team designed Retribution. Lead designer. Share this article. Share.